Thank you for your purchase of a Newport Vessels inflatable boat. First, unpack your boat from its carrying bag. Fully lay out the boat and expand it as much as possible. Using the foot pump, inflate the boat about 30% to provide shape for easier floorboard installation. The Dana will have four floorboards to install in numerical order. Keeping the long side down and the short side on the top, the stringers will latch onto the sides of floorboards three and four. First begin with placing floorboard number one in the bow, aligning the hole over the keel valve. Next, install floorboard number four in the stern, making sure the piece is hooked underneath the lip on the transom. Install floorboard two in place behind board one. Make sure it is fitted into the aluminum holdings. Then, place board three so it is connected to board four. Connecting two and three is easier with two people, but it can be accomplished by yourself. By using an oar as a lever, prop number two and number three up so they join. Then set the floorboards in place by pushing down or stepping on them. Secure the floorboards together by attaching the stringers onto the sides of floorboards three and four. Remember to keep the contoured section against the hull. Next, install the seat by sliding it into place so it is centered on its bracket. Make sure the seat is centered before full inflation. Lastly, you can fully inflate all of the tubes. The foot pump is designed so that you cannot over inflate the chambers. If you're using an electric pump, do not use it to inflate all the way. Always finish inflation with the foot pump. Install your boat's oars and you're ready to hit the water. Enjoy your Newport Vessels boat. See you on the water.